You might be wondering about why this physical reality and the humans who have lived here for quite some time, why it's been so difficult, so challenging, so hard. The ascension, yes, we are in the midst of the ascension. But why did it have to be so dark and so bad for so long? Why, why, why? That's a huge, huge question. And I'm going to get into that more in future videos. What I'd like to address in this video has to do with how to fix it, how to facilitate the ascension, how to get to world peace. You see, these energy fragments of all there is, human souls, souls in general, coming into these bodies, merging with the physical baby and becoming a creator being, this conscious, self-aware creator being that we are. See, we need to, to fix the dark problem, the horribleness of everything that's happened, to fix it, to break free, to break out of this matrix prison. We needed to come into these bodies. We needed to do it here on the proverbial ground and literal ground. See, when you're not in the physical body, you're a much, much more powerful being, per perceptually, because in reality, you're exactly the same, but from a perceived uh, uh, point of view, a perceived stance, you're much, much more powerful when you're not in the physical body. And yes, in that form, you could take the bad guys down. But that's not how this ascension works. This experimental planet, this experiment in general, to fix the issue, to have world peace, to ascend, to break out of the matrix prison, we needed to do it from within. We needed to come here into these bodies, in this physical plane, and shine enough light to end the dark. We needed to come here and do it in the physical. And we have amnesia when we're born, generally speaking, for the most part. So we needed to wake up from the amnesia, remember what we needed to do, and then do it. Now we're doing really well. There are many others who will also articulate this information. The heavy lifting is in the past. Yes, there's more work to be done. But if you can hold your excitement, the high vibe, happy, joyful feelings, hold that as much as possible, that's basically it because the light is ending the dark. Now, duality is going away. I have some videos about what the new earth is like, going to be like, but yeah, no duality. In fact, it's going to be so different than it has been for the last X amount of thousands of years, it's hard to conceive of. Before the Great Flood, we had a time of prosperity, a time of peace, way before the Great Flood. And basically, we're going to have that again. And there's no way to say exactly when, because there are many timelines. But yes, as long, as long as you're feeling excited, you're going to move to that reality faster. If you see Mandela effect, reality shift changes, that is a symptom of this movement to other parallel realities, other timelines. So yeah, hold that vibe. Learn about law of attraction. Learn about quantum jumping. Anything is possible. Try not to feel fear. Fear is the one area that can hold you back. All right, guys. I love you.